Okay. Uh, one of the main direction of the function theory, uh, this talk about function theory, theory of Riemannian surfaces and the harmonic functions, harmonic functions, this uh, uh, Laplace operator U is zero or Laplace operator is positive, it is subharmonic functions. Uh, in Riemannian surface, these objects is very popular. Uh, in the theory of classification of Riemann surfaces, uh, it is one uh, uh, big direction of uh, theory of Riemann surfaces. The class of surfaces for which there is no subharmonic functions bounded from above are called parabolic Riemann surfaces. Parabolic Riemann surfaces. Uh, an example uh, I want to show. Uh, this is not parabolic Riemann surfaces. Uh, uh, because here is bounded to a money function. But all plane is parabolic because uh, on plane, no, is not. Uh, bounded above subharmonic functions. Yeah. Ah, okay. Okay. And light is light to show. No. Okay. Okay. Thank you. In general, when a dimension of X <coughs> Oi, I lost. Okay, okay. Ah, it is very convenient, this one. Doesn't work. Yes. Uh -huh. Okay. Okay. In general, well, uh, when uh, dimensional of X is N, uh, in general case, uh, there are various definitions of parabolicity. Parabolicity uh, where the uh, existence of the special subharmonic Eshausen function is recurred if was uh, can this uh, consider is uh, on the work in the work Griffiths and the King. Uh, this is uh, ATC and the uh, Stoll. Uh, in two books, he introduced this notion, uh, parabolic manifold, parabolic manifold. They are the properties of parabolic manifold, they are applied in the multidimensional Nevalina theory. Nevalina theory. They call it these manifolds parabolic. Uh, Valerian's depict the results of holomorphic mappings of uh, parabolic manifold where considered in the uh, mind uh, paper, in my uh, one paper uh, in Mats Bornik, uh, big paper, I consider parabolic manifold and uh, uh, consider multidimensional Nevalin theory, exactly Valerian defect divisors. Further development of the, of the theory of holomorphic and plurisubharmonic functions on parabolic manifold is connected with the box, uh, very many box uh, in the uh, theory. Uh, it is, I will, I will show after. Uh, it is Zariaki, Dimayi. Uh, in a series of joint paper by Aiden Aituna and uh, me, multidimensional parabolic manifolds were uh, qualified, classified, and their properties of class of holomorphic function on them. Where studied. 
They are in Sabancı University in uh, National University of Uzbekistan. This direction, uh, qualification of parabolic manifold and holomorphic function, they are studied. We gave uh, our definition, uh, Aydın Aytuna and me. Okay, definition. A stain manifold X is called parabolic if it doesn't contain a polysubharmonic function bounded above, except constant. E, uh, uh, it means if uh, U is polysubharmonic on X and U bounded above, then U is constant. This, uh, like this uh, manifold, we uh, call it parabolic. A stain manifold X of dimensional N is called a S parabolic manifold if it has a special exhaustion function rho Z. Rho Z. Uh, exhaustion function, it means uh, it is plurisugarmonic on X. Uh, and the exhaustion, it means uh, every each like this set compact in X, compact is X. Rho tends plus infinity if Z uh, tends to uh, boundary of M. Second, rho Z, rho Z is maximal function outside some compact set, K. It means, uh, operator Monja Ampere is zero on X minus K. Uh, sorry, uh, in PDF file, some, this one I lost, not there, yes. Uh, okay, and uh, ah, uh, this one. Uh, DDC row and uh, this is operator from pluripotential theory. It, it is 80s year, uh, last century. Pluripotential theory, this is operator Monja Ampere, define it as uh, this one DDC, yes, uh, this matrix determinant. A DDC rho n uh, equals zero means this determinant equals zero. Uh, this is well known, uh, the main object in pluripotential theory, pluripotential theory. Under the additional condition, if rho z is uh, continuous, the manifold is called S star parabola. Uh, Griffiths, King, and the Stoll definition, this one, they demand that the rosette is continuous. Continuous, it is enough for them. But in our theory it, uh, uh, of general theory of parabolic manifold, uh, we, in our case, only rho is arbitrary plurisubharmonic functions. Arbitrary plurisubharmonic functions uh, one condition also uh, uh, from low, uh, he bounded, bounded rosette, local bounded. We uh, we take a case when rho is bounded plurisubharmonic functions because in pluripotential theory there is a. Operator Monja Ampera define it only for bounded plurisubharmonic functions. Okay. For Riemannian uh, surfaces, when dimensional is one, the concepts of parabolicity, S parabolicity, and S star parabolicity uh, uh, coincide this. For uh, bigger, Dimensional, the question is still open. 
open. Some some result is some uh, some results we have, but uh, in general case we cannot prove that they these concepts is equal. Okay, on S parabolic manifold, uh, we can define the notion of polynomials uh, as in CN. In CN, we can. Uh, so, one moment. One moment. Definition. If for a function, holomorphic function on Stein, uh, Stein a manifold X, there exists a positive number CD such that logarithm bounded as D rho plus plus C, then uh, this function F is called a rho polynomial, polynomial of degree uh, smaller than D. Smaller than D. The smallest value D in here is called the degree of the polynomial F. We uh, define now polynomial on X and the uh, degree of polynomial. For a fixed number D, for a fixed uh, degree of polynomials, denote by P rho D, space of all polynomials, uh, degree D. And by P rho, uh, all polynomials on X. So we define now uh, space of polynomials on parabolic manifold X. It is proved, it is in our work, uh, that dimensional of P rho D is C D P plus one. In C N, C is one, but in arbitrary uh, parabolic manifold, C may be more than one. The simplest example of parabolic manifold is complex space CN. Complex space CN, where exhaustion function is logarithm Z. Uh, logarithm Z, you, you see uh, this function is uh, maximal, more jumper uh, satisfied, but uh, only in one to point, Z is zero. Uh, yeah, I, I said that outside some compact set. Compact set here is zero. Okay. Uh, arbitrary algebraic manifold, algebraic manifold equals in CN also parabolic. Uh, for this example, there is a rich set of polynomials for this. Uh, Parabolic set X, we have a rich set, rich, rich family of polynomials. But it is interesting. Now, what, uh, was a time, uh, in some time, we think that uh, this X is in CN. In CN is a coordinate function, W1, W2, and uh, sometimes we think that every coordinate time is for uh, some polynomials. But uh, Aydin is some, uh, you, uh, his colleague notes that coordinate, uh, sometime coordinate function is not parabolic. And after, after this uh, notation, uh, we uh, looking for a manifold, they are very poor polynomials. And we construct very interesting example. Here, publish it here. So, one moment. Example. We construct a parabolic manifold X on which uh, there are no non-trivial polynomials except constant. 
except only constant is uh, polynomials. Uh, other polynomials is not in parabolic manifold X. I give uh, uh, the example is not easy. It is very complicated, very uh, uh, big, uh, complicated example. And I give only ideas of construction uh, this parabolic manifold. First, uh, the existence of a compact set and a special potential contributes to the construction of such a manifold. First, there exists a polar counter compact set on plane, polar contact, a counter, counter compact set on plane. K is counter set in R, R is in C on the plane. And they probably measure mu on K for which the potential, u mu, this potential, is subharmonic on C, on the plane subharmonic, and the outside K is harmonic, such that u mu on K is minus infinity, minus infinity. And uh, moreover, this function, this uh, potential of measure mu satisfies this condition, condition two. This condition minus, uh, means that u mu tends minus infinity, very slow, very slow. I want uh, to show. This is all plain. See, uh, here is all counter set. This is K. And uh, we find some probably measure mu supported on K such that this potential. Logarithmic potential. Okay. Uh, superharmonic. It is clear that this is superharmonic because logarithm is superharmonic. This is probably measured, positive measure, and this is integral is superharmonic. Uh, outside K. Mu supported in K. Also, K not mu. And this is harmonic. Also, K is this harmonic. And uh, I choose mu specially that this uh, tends minus infinity. Minus infinity very slow, slow, lovely. Uh, minus infinity. So uh, with this property, now after construction, this potential, I put I put our manifold is C uh, Riemannian ball. This is C, uh, C uh, plane plus uh, infinity. C, uh, this over C over line minus K. Outside K, it is our manifold. I show that this manifold is a parabolic. First, I take. Uh, as rho z, this potential uh, is minus, minus potential. We see uh, this is exhaustion first because rho z tends plus infinity as z tends to k. 
first condition is. Uh, second condition, it is harmonic. Uh, it means Monjamper is equal. Third, uh, one, one point uh, in infinitive, it is not harmonic. This is compact. Compact is one point, infinitive point. Thus, it means rho is uh, special exhaustion function on our manifold X. It means X is a star parabolic manifold, a star parabolic manifold. So, uh, I pr uh, we prove that uh, polynomials on X trivial. Every polynomial on X is trivial. What is poly polynomials on X? It is holomorphic function on X, holomorphic function outside K, holomorphic outside K, and in infinity also holomorphic. And uh, for which uh, this inequality holds. Some kind of stand, D, some D, some kind of stand, holds. Uh, then we will show that F is constant. F is constant. This easily follows from uh, this theorem, a general theorem, I will say, a general proposition. Let K is polar compact or on plane, polar compact. If F is holomorphic outside K, and the limit F distance ZK is zero, then F is holomorphic on all C over line C. Uh, over line C, every function, it is compact, every function by uh, maximal principle is constant. Uh, like this function is constant. In one case, when F bounded function, it is easy to prove. It is easy if uh, F bounded uh, on K, on polar K, then F is constant. It is very well known and uh, in Moscow, who where I was uh, aspirant. It was very uh, known. Uh, and there we do the all time uh, study. If K is compact of analytics capacity zero, analytic capacity, uh, 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 and instant uh, every polar set is zero analytic capacity. Analytic capacity, if F bounded here, then K to be, uh, can remove uh, on K also holomorphic. Every like this function is holomorphic. But our case, uh, our case you see, F not bounded, but bounded, big bound, uh, F distance, this one uh, it means if uh, Deeply bounded. As this one if bounded, it is a known theory. And then deeply bounded. It also, I think, is where. Okay. But this theorem we cannot uh, prove. Uh, maybe is somewhere this theorem. Uh, now it is problem, but in our case, I and uh, 
uh, Aydin, we prove, prove this theorem for our case, for counter set and uh, for uh, uh, our function. For our function, we can prove uh, if this means so if a bounded slowly, uh, uh, weakly. In this case, we prove. But in a uh, general case, with this condition, it is, I think, maybe no problem. Maybe somebody prove it. Maybe some way uh, is this result. Uh, for our case, it is true. OK, it means uh, polynomials, every polynomial is constant. No polynomials in uh, our manifold, parabolic manifold, no uh, bounded. Uh, uh, it is uh, no uh, polynomials. So no polynomials, it is very bad. And uh, so, I want a very definition. I want definition. So, and we can do following definition. S parabolic manifold is called a regular parabolic manifold. Uh, if the space of polynomials is dense, on the space of all holomorphic functions, every holomorphic function approximated by polynomials, by polynomials. So uh, we have uh, parabolic manifold where no uh, polynomials uh, is parabolic manifold where maybe PD is not dense on OX, but we consider only parabolic manifold for which uh, P dense on X. In our uh, examples, uh, very many examples of regular parabolic manifold, an example CM parabolic manifold, we know every holomorphic in CM function approximated by polynomials. Second, uh, Algebraic set, algebraic manifold. Algebraic manifold in CN, according to the well known theorem of Walter Rudin, we can assume up to a suitable affine transformation that A is uh, like this, uh, least on. Uh, uh, algebraic conus. So and now, uh, if we say rho is uh, logarithm W prime, then this instruction rho A is special exhaustion function, a special exhaustion function, because this function is special exhaustion function on, on the project. And if you up, this project, we take exhaustion function, first exhaustion function, second uh, maximal function, Monjamper satisfies Monjamper equation. And uh, this function has only a few a finite number where maximality is not true. So rho is, uh, yes, ah, we see, Polynomials on A on algebraic set is a restriction of uh, polynomials in CN on A restriction. We see that in this case, uh, uh, P uh, space of polynomials is dense in the space of uh, holomorphic functions. So uh, we have a rich uh, parabolic manifolds, regular parabolic manifolds, because algebraic set and also very many uh, other parabolic manifolds where space of polynomials is dense uh, 
uh, on uh, holomorphic space of holomorphic function. Now uh, we now begin our uh, the main uh, paragraph uh, section, polynomial approximation and other of convergence and the <laughs> order of convergence on regular parabolic manifold. We have to consider only regular parabolic. If we want uh, approximate every holomorphic function by polynomials, we uh, must consider only regular parabolic manifold. In this year, 62, Joseph Sichek proved the following generalization of the classical Bernstein Walsh theorem in CN. In CN, uh, I remember Sichek visit to Moscow and in seminar of Gonchar, he uh, give talk about this and uh, every mathematicians around Gonchar, Vitushkin surprised that this is a very nice theorem, uh, very good theorem in CN. Sichak uh, theorem, if let compacts in CN, regular compact, no good compact. This is uh, infimum between norm F and P. This is uh, how close our function to polynomials. A degree is D. Okay, then the function F originally defined on compact set K holomorphically extends to a neighborhood DR where this is, uh, uh, we say, green function. He is green function, polynomial, this one, and the supremum, this one, green function. I, I will uh, back to this theorem. If and only if this limit speed, uh, speed of convergence polynomials uh, Oh, uh, I explained this theorem very uh, important theorem uh, in our talk. This is compact. If speed. E M uh, one B one here B is if speed is as geometrical progression. Then this or our function original defined on K tends holomorphically continue to this G row, I think B row, G row. Here F will continue to this neighborhood. And the opposite, if F is uh, holomorphic here, GM, then speed is as geometrical progression. Geometrical progression. This is very nice theorem. And uh, uh, in this area works Vislav uh, Zaharyuta also, and another mathematician. <laughs> Okay. Recording in progress. Ah, DR. DR. Okay. Uh, 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 if a function holomorphic here in DR, then speed is 
limit limit uh, the speed is uh, smaller than one over r. Okay. Well, and opposite, if speed is as geometrical progression, then F originally defined on compact set K holomorphically extends continue to some neighborhood of K. Very many results was uh, Zaharuta by analysis method, uh, he proved this theorem uh, by using a functional analysis and the Ganchar, Chirka works in this direction. Ganchar and Chirka uh, uh, for rational functions. Uh, and uh, now our theorem, our theorem, uh, mine and uh, Ali Mardan, Atamuratov, Ali Mardan is uh, my student and uh, Aydin student. We together works, uh, joint student, Alimarna Tamrata. Uh, let X be S parabolic manifold. And the rho is spatial exhaustion function on X, on X, not CS. Denote by space of polynomials uh, of degree D. Let this is. Uh, uh, infimum, minimal distance from F to space of polynomials, polynomials D. Okay. Uh, extremal function on parabolic manifold define it similarly, this one. And uh, uh, this uh, extremal function uh, fol uh, has following properties. Monotonicity, first, second, four. Ah, it is holds through a Bernstein Walsh inequality. For arbitrary polynomials, this inequality is true. This, you see, uh, arbitrary polynomials, norm on K, and the green function. Uh, degree P, degree P. Uh, P at a common for all polynomials. Good. If K is polynomial, the convex hull of the compact, then uh, green is the same. Green is the same. I formulate the following theorem. Let K is compact, regular compact, and the uh, parabolic manifold also is regular. Then a function, a function F defined on K holomorphically extends to domain D, the same D, if and only if the inequality holds and the, uh, the speed is one over R. If uh, our function f holomorphic in some neighborhood of k. Uh, I want to say that uh, the proof of this theorem essentially differs from a similar theorem in CN. Uh, Atamuratov a very long time wanted to prove this. Uh, and uh, in last year, we find new method to prove this theorem because in CN, uh, c use a veil integral formula, veil formula, and the theorem of Heffer. This, this theorem uh, is not on parabolic manifold. Heffer theorem also is not. Veil theorem, a very, some different uh, version of veil theorem is, but not for us. And the, we, we will use 
I will show, uh, we will use uh, uh, another method based on the on one to one embedding of the manifold X into a complex space CM of high dimensional. Next, we use also We use also that every holomorphic function approximated by polynomials. We use also that our parabolic manifold is regular. Uh, short proof I did. Uh, how many time I have? Five minutes. Ten minutes. Okay, ten minutes is okay. So, uh, as efficiency carried out in the same way as in CN, because if this inequality is true, then then uh, is true, uh, then the series, this series, according to the Bernstein Walsh inequality, uh, we have P minus PD, uh, this is Benstein walsh inequality. Uh, this is two R minus epsilon degree D and phi. And we see this series converges in our domain, in this domain, uh, uniformly converges. Uh, if uniformly converges, it means the sum is holomorphic. This sum is holomorphic. Holomorphic and equal F uh, on K. Uh, Sufficient is uh, very easy. Now, necessity. <clears throat> if F is holomorphic in the domain, in our domain R, then there exists a finite set of polynomials such that this one on the boundary is like this. Uh, I want to show. Mm. If this is P by uh, P logarithm uh, on k p is equal one this one this one and this is this neighbor but this is supremum of polynomials for every point there exists one polynomial they are <coughs> this polynomial is close to logarithm f one polynomial uh, polynomial is continuous, and in some neighborhood, uh, <coughs> the is close. We find finite number of polynomials and the supreme of finite numbers is close to logarithm. Ah. It means geometrically uh, these polynomials. Even of polynomials, five number of polynomials, and here they are all compact. Uh, picture is like this five polynomials. Uh, this part, I it is a polyhedral beam, polyhedral beam, uh, and the, uh, but uh, in different of. The CN, we cannot uh, write integral formula of the. In this case, we uh, do the next. The next. I find polynomials, finite number M, <coughs> M may be very big, <coughs> epsilon fixed, <coughs> logarithm R minus epsilon. Okay. <clears throat> uh, 
under rising this PG degree doesn't uh, play pay any role. Under rising is Z, I uh, may assume that S E uh, for all polynomials the same. The same. S G is S. And consider this polynomial. <clears throat> and I consider the embedding. Embed. This is uh, our P G R E K S and the P uh, one and uh, I take map P P this map two uh, C M some uh, bigger complex space. This is proper condition may not work because one to one these uh, maps maybe not one to one uh, not one to one maybe a priori when we add to these polynomials new coordinate function on cn coordinate function w w n now this collect <coughs> is one to one because coordinate function is one to one. Uh, it is embedding, but we don't know a coordinate function is polynomial or no. Uh, sometimes it is not, I said, it is not polynomial. Uh, then uh, V, uh, X is regular polynomials, parabolic, and we can approximate this coordinate function. And we can uh, take this, Another polynomial approximating, we can take, we can find uh, very many polynomials and uh, consider a new polyhedron. Polyhedron, this one, very big uh, degree of complex space. And now it is uh, embedding, embedding one to one this map as one to one, we consider uh, image of uh, the P uh, uh, or P here and the uh, uh, PX is subset of some analytic set A is good. Now, uh, Aka Kartan theorem, uh, I find, uh, in C M plus N and here some analytic set, algebraic set, and our our situation P P L is here profit. Is now we use theorem Cartan. Okay. Theorem Cartan. If some holomorphic function here, you can extend it to P. It is okay. In P, everything is okay. After we can find uh, polynomial approximation. I now finished, uh, but I show. Oh, uh, to approximate this one, approximation in polyhedron, this one, and after, uh, after it is calculation. I want to show uh, papers. This is Griffith's King, uh, first paper, who introduced parabolic manifold. This is Stoll, also in Nivalina theory, he used uh, parabolic manifolds. Uh, it is uh, 80 year in Matsubornik, very big uh, paper. Uh, and Zariachi, Dimayi, other after, uh, other afters, they are uh, Aitona and me, 
paper. Uh, also, much Scandinavia proved it. As here, uh, we uh, introduce regular parabolic manifold. We find, we find uh, example where no uh, uh, non trivial polynomials. I finish. Thank you.